three minutes. This is the last plan, action plan for housing and homeless, 2006. The only difference I see is there are two gentlemen introducing that. There are three gentlemen introducing this one. And in that one, we were told by Minister Simon Coveney, a truly ambitious social housing programme, 47,000 units will be delivered with the funding of 5.35 billion by 2021. Didn't happen. We have Enda Kenny, former Taoiseach, telling us the range of options is ambitious and so on. And then this is this one. I've read both of them. So sad is my life that I read both of them to try and see was there something positive I could say? And I certainly could. There are some positive initiatives in it. My difficulty is that you're following the same failed model. And we're being accused of ideology. And I don't think that the Minister for Housing is going to listen to me. But I was elected. And I was elected to give voice to those who think differently and who want to give constructive criticism and want to show that there's a different way. And we have a minister make a speech today, and in case we were any doubt, he told us, this is a plan for the squeezed middle. Hear that now, minister, that you're part of this government, a plan for the squeezed middle. And in his introduction, one of the three men who did the introductions, he repeatedly used the word squeezed middle and kept telling us, in case we were any doubt. So in two and a half pages of an introduction, he tells us four times. And then he tells us, who are they? They are the squeezed middle. And in case we don't know who they are, they are the people who work hard and play by the rules, but they seem to have nothing to show for it at the end of the day. Can you imagine that as, as a basis for a housing plan for all to inspire confidence? Something as divisive and terrible as that to inspire confidence in us. And I look at Galway, beautiful Galway city, and we look at that and we see the homeless figures. Nationally, 8,212 people in emergency accommodation. In Galway, 241 homeless adults in emergency accommodation and so on. The prices have gone up by 14.3%. People on a waiting list going back to 2005. A housing task force that was set up in 19 never once produced an annual report that I've had sight of. And that was one of the nine terms of reference to produce it. We're being accused of ideology. The ideology is on the part of the government who believe the market will provide. The market has utterly failed to provide. There is a role for the market, but the role has to be for the state in giving a strong message. We are not talking about a home as a commodity. A home is the most basic unit, and we will provide homes, public homes on public land that will bring down the price of the houses because you're artificially keeping the prices up. Over a billion, I understand, will go into HAP alone. I welcome the fact that you're going to phase it out gradually, but it was one of the biggest mistakes. So Thank when you, you talk about billions going into social housing, it's going into the private landlord's pocket. Am I over time or under time, sorry? No, I'm over time, sorry. I beg your pardon. I beg your pardon.